This HAN Network video is brought to you by SCAP Auto Group. From Danbury High School, this is the HAN Network's 2017 Fall Sports Tour. I'm Frank Granito sitting alongside the Hatters Swimming and Diving Captains. They are Ayadiri Perez, Grace Lang, and Cassandra Lopez. Girls, thank you so much for taking time with us this morning. Cassandra, let me start with you. Being named a captain heading into your senior season, what did that mean to you? That meant almost the world to me when she told me that I was going to be the 2018 17 um, captain of the swim team because it always meant so much to me because I've been on the team since my freshman year and I just became so uh, such a so in love with all my teammates and I've always just wanted to be the captain and, and Grace as you look back on your career and some of the previous captains that you have had what were the lessons you've learned from those groups that this group now wants to bring forward into the 2017 season well, some lessons I think we learned were about sharing responsibilities and um, kind of giving everyone attention so everyone can improve. And I dare you now, as you guys get ready to start practice next week, let's talk a little bit about the summer. What was the training like for the Hatters? How does everyone stay in shape and make sure that, uh, that you guys are ready for this year? Well, <laughs> we have something called, we did, um, we're going to do, and we're doing right now, it's called Hell Week. So we all meet up with the girls, the existing girls already, the girls that have been on the team already. And we do conditioning, we do some running, and then, like, myself, a part of that, I've done some swimming, and I've been I've been practicing on in the water. So we're all, as a team, we're all practicing on land, getting our stamina up, because, you know, in the summer we all get lazy. So we have to get that stamina back up to get to have a good year well you mentioned that the existing girls on the team we were talking off the air and you guys talked about this will be a big roster this year for the Danbury swimming and diving team what role will this group play in helping all the new faces and younger girls get acclimated to being on the team um, well we're gonna try to find right now we need a lot more girls like in other strokes because we have a lot of girls for freestyle so what we're trying to accomplish is get more girls doing more strokes to see what they're good at and they're be able to because we've always lacked a little bit of girls so we've always had to repeat girls when we put them in races so this year we have enough girls to not have to repeat have more girls on another race like do you know do you know what i'm trying to mean yeah so like i'm trying to like so like we have enough girls to have to have each on their own race so that's what we're trying to learn to see if they're good at backstroke and butterfly and breast. So, yeah. And now, Grace, as important as all of the training in the pool is, outside of practice, outside of meets, what does this team like to do together that really builds that team camaraderie? Well, we really like the bus ride homes from swim meets, and we just play music, and sometimes we eat ice cream, and it is the funnest thing ever. We've had a couple pasta parties where we just, oh, it's so much fun. I, I can't describe it. And Cassandra, now, as you guys look ahead to this season, what are the goals this team is hoping to set and accomplish together? We are hoping to win another one of our meets because this year we actually won one of our first meets in a long time, in almost like 12 years, against um, St. Joe's. And we, are, we were very excited about that, and we just hope to keep striving for more success. Well, it should be a lot of fun. Great year. Last question across the board. I'll start with you. Is one game, or excuse me, one race you guys are most excited for this season? Which one do you think that would be? Um, I'm excited for the 100 fly. Okay. I'm really excited to see um, which girl can do those because that was usually my stroke, and I can pass it on to another girl. <laughs> it should be fun. What about you, Grace? Um, probably the relays because I like having four girls swim one event because you get to cheer for all of them, and it's very special. Be good. Cassandra? Um, for me, it would most likely be the 50 um, backstroke in the relay because this would be like my first year kind of going into backstroke because I think I've been improving more this summer with practicing it. So. Well, girls, we want to wish you the best of luck this season in the pool. We can't wait to see you and the rest of the Hatters out there. Thank you so much for coming on with us this morning. Oh, thank you. Alongside the swimming and diving captains at Danbury High School, this is the HAN Network's 2017 Fall Sports Tour. Stay tuned as we continue on to the rest of the conference.